What happens to your body after drinking a cup of coffee? After coffee enters the stomach from the mouth, he won't be here for long. It will soon enter the small intestine. You all know that. The small intestine is the organ that absorbs nutrients. His intestinal wall is densely covered with fluff. Caffeine and coffee will pass through these fluff into the body's bloodstream. Then it comes to the brain. Then caffeine stimulates the central nervous system, which in turn produces dopamine. It's the key to keeping your head up. Dopamine makes you feel high and happy. At this point, you will feel your heart beating faster. Breathing becomes rapid, and this is where the magic happens. You find your productivity. It actually improved a lot, and you're getting it wrong. I mistakenly believe that coffee is a good thing. With the intervention of the brain, you will develop a heavy dependence on coffee. After becoming addicted to coffee, it's hard to quit it. When you try to quit coffee, you may find yourself prone to anxiety. Symptoms such as fatigue and headaches. Numerous studies have shown that people who like to drink coffee, the body will inevitably suffer some damage. For example, the function of the kidneys will have some impact, lead to frequent urination, prone to dehydration. Therefore, it is best to drink some water properly after drinking coffee. Not everyone is suitable for drinking coffee. For example, cardiovascular and cerebrovascular patients are not suitable for drinking. It's best not to be greedy for coffee.